Hey, what's up? Tony with BMW Ride Your Dad here, and <clears throat> it's 5.30 in the morning on my first trip of the day. It's a 27-minute north Uber ride, and um, I'm going to try to do this vlogging today. Got a different setup, so it's been a pain on the GoPro. So I'm going to give you guys some updates throughout the day. So, got my first trip done, that was uh, to the airport, now it's 6 o'clock and I'm headed out of the airport, no rematch, it's hard to get a rematch at this time of day, not very many people have gotten into the airport yet, but, um, so right now I'm on my way into uh, town so I can start a consecutive trip bonus. Uh, I might actually put Lyft on as well um, because they have a streak bonus and the trick that I use for that is I put on select only so I don't have to turn the app off and break the streak for consecutive trip and so that way I can um, go ahead and get both bonuses and with uber you'll be able to get multiple consecutive trips at a time uh, once you've completed a set as long as it's still in the time frame so like today or right now this consecutive streak bonus is for uh 6 a.m. and 9 a.m. so I should be able to get a couple maybe even three um, different ones so it's three for four dollars and fifty cents extra um, and then on Lyft it's three for six dollars which um, you can only do that once and <clears throat> last week for Lyft it was much better I was able to get three for fifteen dollars in the morning evening it was five for 25 and that was every day so I made pretty good money on Lyft I know I said I wasn't going to be driving Lyft but um, I'm not so sure what they're doing with their pay structure and everything uh, it hasn't changed in Colorado and I'm not so sure if it's still the low pay in the, um, other cities as it, as it was um, or if they changed it back but I haven't heard anything about it, and so I'm just going to be using Lyft as well until something solid comes through that they are actually changing the bonus or the um, fare for us. And <clears throat> but until then, I will be using Lyft. And like last week, I made a lot more money using Uber and Lyft side by side. Um, those streak bonuses are a big part of that, but um, Lyft has gotten a lot busier than it was um, before I stopped using it. So, if you only can drive Lyft, um, you can go ahead and probably be able to be okay with that if you have something against Uber or if Uber doesn't approve you or you get deactivated or something. Um, it's still an option here in Denver and it's still, you can make pretty good money, so, um, I guess that last trip that I did at the airport, um, the lady was just telling me about how her experiences as a passenger have been, and she said she's only given two one stars and we're talking about star ratings I guess there's this uber elite status I've never heard of um, that one of our drivers told her about I don't know if he was just making stuff up or not but um, apparently if you get in the top 2% of uber rated drivers then you can be listed as an elite driver on your app 
not so sure it matters too much because you don't get paid extra for that anyways. So maybe they'll uh, not deactivate you if people do false reports on you or something. I don't know. Probably not. All right. Well, I will uh, check back in with you in a little bit. All right. So just to get a little bit of an update, it's... Um, 10:30. I'm at $117 on Uber, on Lyft. I'm at $32. So not too bad. Um, I had quite a bit of trips going on, so I couldn't just like stop and do some video shooting because they're pretty quick in between trips. And <clears throat> so right now with uber i have nine more trips left to get to my bonus i selected the 50 and 60 trip bonus um, nine more trips to get to 60 dollars and then um, if i do 10 more today after that then i can get up to 80 bucks um, i decided to select some of the lower ones so i could run lift and still get some bonuses and lifts um, streak bonus this week was only six dollars per streak so that's why I didn't go for um, a lower one on Uber and run lift more frequently um, I just happened to get the streak today on lift didn't really uh, want to try to drive into the territory required to start the uber consecutive trips so um, looking at the map didn't seem like downtown searched it all this morning anyways is all around um, different areas uh, so i didn't really miss out on a whole lot downtown but typically i've been trying to get downtown by like 6 30 ish and then uh, between like seven and nine, it's usually surging somewhat a little bit. So uh, right now I'm just waiting on a trip and I'm kind of in the Capitol Hill area here. And seems like things have slowed down at 1030 on this Thursday. So right now I'm probably gonna end up uh, heading towards the house and meeting up with the wife and kids for some lunch. All right. All right. So I am now officially on my way to meet with my wife and kids for lunch. Um, <clears throat> on Uber. I made it to $146 and on Lyft I made it to $33. So just rounded up to $34 because between the two changes I have another dollar. Um, so I also have $10 in cash tips. So yeah, I believe that's $1.90. So, um, $190 in six and a half hours, that's not too bad. Um, we'll see how it goes for the rest of the day. I am still seven trips away from the first $60 and then for 20 more dollars I'm 10 more trips away so um, it's quite a bit of trips if I keep getting long trips uh, to think I'll be able to accomplish that but I think it's possible to at least get the 60 bucks um, my wife and I we've been having a goal of $2,500 between the two of us um, and kind of taking turns on days getting a day off and been doing a lot more of homeschool with the kids been, uh, I think it's been working out well we have had 
quite a bit of time together as well so uh, and I think the schedule that we're working with right now has been one of the better ones we've come up with so and not having to worry about trying to get that big big bonus which ends up I don't know I think it really locks away some of the potential money you're losing out on for running lift when Uber's dead and um, trying to get a bonus I don't know I think I was making an average of like 21 22 dollars an hour when it was just Uber even with the bonuses um, now that I'm running both of the apps I'm closer to 25 to 30 depending on the week. Alright, so I guess once I get started back up again, I will check back in. Alright, so it's 345 and I'm getting back on the road. I just got the car washed and vacuumed. And now I'm just waiting for a trip. And... Yeah, my totals are still about the same. I think I got a tip. But, um... I do have... Seven more trips till I get $60. So, let's see how quickly I can get that done. Alright, so... It's the... Pretty much the end of the day. 8.15... I um, made the first part of the quest. I am not going to do the second part. I do have my app on on my way home, but um, definitely not going to be able to get 10 trips in, probably, unless I want to stay up till 4 a.m., and that's not something I'm wanting to do. And I also don't want to go downtown to try to get a bunch of little rides doesn't even look busy down there anyways so probably wouldn't be worth the trip so um, ended up at $235 on Uber 33 on Lyft got some cash tips haven't counted them at all um, and so yeah between the bonus Uber Lyft $320 a day not too bad about 10 hours of driving and um, tomorrow we are going to be doing a double up day she's going to drive I'm going to drive um, and then same on Saturday that is because we're getting some help from my in-laws and got to take advantage of that when we can um, and then they get to take advantage of seeing the kids so it's a win-win there um, definitely appreciate their help and I'm going to try to get better at doing these vlogging ones sorry about the, the lighting I'm just driving home and it's dark and <clears throat> but I'm going to try to get better at doing these vlogs give you better updates and everything so um, thanks for hanging in there hope everybody has a good day um, go ahead and make money if you have any questions leave me a comment you can email me bearditdaddy23 at gmail.com and um, if you have any questions you can reach out to me there sorry that it's been a while since I've posted I just like I said at the beginning of this trying to simplify how to get these videos going and um, using the phone instead of the GoPro cuts out quite a bit of video transfer so all right we will uh, try doing this vlog again tomorrow and I'll try to post them as I do them all right